What's going on YouTube? Thanks again for stopping by. Sean here, aka Sean the Barber, Sean Myers, whatever you want to call it, that's who I am. And I just appreciate you stopping by. In today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to do a high skin fade, also known as the high and tight, whatever you prefer. And I'll make it so easy that even your grandma can do it for you. Don't that sound like fun? Well, if it does, please go down below, please like and subscribe, and I can keep you guys updated with new videos. Peace. Alright, as always, I want to demonstrate the clippers. Halfway, all the way open, closed. Halfway, all the way open. So the last time I cut my hair down, it was a number three, so I'm just going back over it again with a number three. Also, I want to apologize in advance, I look a little bit like Krusty Krabs. I was at the beach today, and I got a little burnt. Now I'm just taking the two real quick, all the way open. And I'm just knocking down that bulk in heavy areas. So about your pair of outliners and let's begin. This is a high fade, so you're gonna want to go pretty high up. Make a nice, nice neat line if you can. The best you can. And I tell you, this is one of the easiest fades. Your line should look something like this. It's easy once you get the hang of it, so don't worry. And as usual, I'll be demonstrating on this side, and then once I'm finished with this side, I'll go ahead and speed up, speed it up on the other side. All right, once you're finished with that nice line, just wanna take your clippers all the way open. Start going up about half an inch. Following that same guideline that you first started with, only going up about half an inch. Now adjust your clippers to halfway open. Now don't go up past the second line you created. You want to stay underneath that second line that you created. Now all the way closed. Try to pop out that first original line that you made. Just flicking that out, that bottom line. So far so good, right? Piece of cake. And after that's done, whip out your zero guard. Same step, all the way open and begin. Going up about half an inch. Nice and easy, nice proportioned lines. Really, it's not that hard. You guys can figure it out. It might take some time, but you got it. Close it halfway. Stay underneath that third line.
Now you didn't see me do it, but I did it. I just uh, closed the clippers all the way closed, and now I'm just flicking out that second line. So it's starting to come together now. Now, just like the previous steps, we're going to put on the one. One guard right there, all the way open. We're going to go nice and neat, up about half an inch, and stay right on that line. Follow that line all the way back. Now we're going to go halfway closed, staying underneath that fourth line, working our way down a little bit. Now we're going to close her all the way up and flick out that third line. I'll pop on that one and a half guard. Same like before, all the way open. Just fanning it into that two where I originally started at on the side. Then close her halfway, staying underneath that line. Close her all the way up. See, pretty much done. It was that easy, right? You got it. I know it can be a little tricky, but like I said in my previous videos, if you have any questions, please go to the comment section below and ask me anything. I'll help you. Now I'm just going to go back over the fade and clean it up a little bit, put on the one and I'm working my way back down just going over the heavier spots. Be careful in these stages not to go too high. Stay underneath the previous guard that you did before. Same with the one like I just did. Now I'm putting on the zero and I'm staying underneath of the one going lower with the zero all the way open. Just going and hitting out some of those heavier spots. Just be patient, take your time and it'll all come together nicely. Now I'm just going to be doing a little outline work on this side for demonstration. Once I'm finished with this, I'm going to hop on the other side and speed that other side up. And you can check that out one last time. Now I'm going to speed things up for you a little bit. Once you created that other line on the other side, you want to go ahead and work your way up with the, all the way open on your clippers, no guard. And then stand underneath that second line, halfway closed. And then after halfway closed, close them all the way up and pop out that bottom line. Now I'm putting on the zero guard in the same steps, all the way open. And then halfway, staying underneath that third line. And then all the way closed to pop out that second line. I'm smashing on that one going up a quarter inch just like the other side and halfway closed and then all the way closed then to pop out that third fourth line and I 
got the one and a half one there. Fan it into the two all the way open. Then you close it halfway. And then all the way closed. Then I just go back over it just like the other side. Like I said, this can be a little tricky. I get it. Just like other videos I tried to explain before, it's a little confusing at first. But I can guarantee you, you ask me a question, I'll be there to help you, if anything. So don't be, don't be scared to ask, and I'll have your back. Well, I hope this video helped, guys. So, if you liked what you see, please like and subscribe, and even hit that bell. Here's the aftermath.